My name is Ryan Lee. I'm the chair of the Department of Radiology in the Einstein Healthcare Network, which is now part of Jefferson Health. Uh, and in, at Einstein, we have the full suite of, uh, of algorithms that AI Doc offers. And when you have a, uh, a system that can actually alert you to an abnormal funny, you can go right to that particular case and take care of that patient in notifying the referring doctor sooner than had you just simply gone in a chronological oldest case first, and you might not get to it until maybe 10, 15, maybe even 20 or 30 minutes later. So that sort of triaging can be very beneficial in terms of workflow and getting uh, abnormal results faster to the referring doctors. My experience working with ADOC has been nothing but amazing. When it comes down to it, technology obviously is important that it works well, but it's the people that make the difference in a good implementation versus an implementation that might be not as good. I've mentioned that people and um, the responsiveness of a company is clearly very important, but the actual technology also has to work as well. And so you, you gotta look for algorithms that are actually going to ultimately help. So the PE algorithm is an example of such a, a fantastic algorithm that is very sensitive uh, and also very specific. And the incidental portion of the PE algorithm, for example, is very useful. So it's one thing when we're keyed in, of course, as radiologists, we're always keyed into looking at all the images for everything. Uh, but when you get a study for PE, a CT of the chest looking for PE, clearly you have that in the back of your mind that that's one thing you absolutely have to look for. Um, with incidental findings, suppose you had a study for something else, for example, you had an abdomen pelvis CT and you might find an incidentally a PE there. While of course, we're always supposed to look, and we all do, that might be secondary in our mind when we're looking for whatever the the indication for that study is. So I think uh, incidental findings like that can be a very useful case study in the implementation of AI. I think the use cases for how AI can be deployed are just beginning and that there are going to be many use cases that will be developed over time in addition to triage.